Good morning, good afternoon, and good evening, everybody. Thank you for tuning in to another Super Tease video. And in this one, I will be covering my top five add-ons for PvP in Dragonflight. These are five add-ons that anybody can download at any time that will dramatically increase your success when it comes to PvP, especially in solo queue. I would say that these add-ons are of pinnacle importance if you want to be having success in that bracket because they are going to just open your eyes to a brand whole new world. You've really got to check them out. And if you want to stay up to date with news and information related to World of Warcraft so you're always a bit ahead of the competition, then do make sure to hit the subscribe button. Your support is greatly appreciated on my journey and goal of getting to 100,000 subscribers. And right now we're pretty close to the halfway point of 50,000 and I'd really love to hit it. So thank you for your support and thank you even if you haven't hit the button just for tuning into the video. I hope that you're going to get a lot out of it. Now moving into the first add-on of the top five. This add-on is going to be called big debuffs. This is an add-on that is very important for healers, but also very important for damage dealers. And what you can see that it does is this little block on my priest is a fear, which means they're crowd controlled. As a healer, this means that uh, this is something that's going to help me dispel that target. Dispels seem to be very slow in solo queue because normally you, you have your partner in your ear telling you, hey, I'm caught in crowd control. Can you help me out? This add-on will help highlight that you're in crowd control. Now, why do you need this as a damage dealer? Well, if this fear was on me, the druid as a healer, you would know that I'm feared and you need to be using a defensive cooldown so big debuffs is something that like when I'm at when it actually is working which it has been since the most recent update for me at least uh it, it just skyrockets my rating uh, my awareness to cc because usually this debuff frame is very poor it's just tracking useless debuffs that are unimportant this just enables you to see the most important ones the vital ones big and shiny you can customize it a little bit if you don't want the default this is me just running a default just plug and play downloaded it sent it and and now I've got it. So my rating always goes up when I play with this add-on. Absolutely a must-have for DPS and healers. It's going to help you out so much. The next one is going to be Gladiator Losa and or Weak Auras. The reasons that I like Gladiator Losa is because it's just plug and play. You just downloaded it and it's going to start working. Weak Auras, you're going to need to find a package. You're going to have to set it up a little bit, although it is just as good. Uh, basically, what this is going to do is it's going to take the audio files in the game uh, for abilities and then convert them into verbal language so that you can hear what is being casted um, rather than needing to kind of filter through all the different audio files of grunting demons and imps and stuff. Uh, this is an add-on that's really good for newcomers if you've never played PvP before or somebody who has tunnel vision, which I have seen a lot of people talking about when they come to my stream, which is also linked in the description down below. Uh, so if you have a problem like staring at health bars, not paying attention to the whole screen, this add-on will help you because it's going to take your ears into account and you can hear cooldowns being casted like, oh, polymorph's being casted. I know maybe my healer is about to get CC'd or maybe I am and I need to interrupt it uh, and it's going to help you out without taking away from your attention or whatever it may be that you're currently learning on. In the long term, I don't like relying on these add-ons. I, I think that they do eventually they're kind of like training wheels. It's, it's good to grow out of them rather than constantly having a reliance on them. But if you want something that's just going to be jumping up your rating because you've got problems like tunnel visioning and not a lot of awareness, then this add-on is going to really support you um, in that element and likely get you a lot of rating just by downloading it, turning it on, and playing with it. The number three add-on is going to be Omnibar. So this is an add-on that uh, gets tracked in the middle of your screen or you can move it around obviously and this tracks enemy cooldowns and when they're activated but more importantly lets you see when they're about to be available again. So we can use Gladiator Losa like we said. It would have said Colossus Smash and that means the warrior is going to be doing big damage and I can see it activated by this glowing bar and a cooldown on it so I know when the next big threat is going to be available. I can also track interrupts or mechanics like Spell Reflect so that I can tell oh Oh, all the interrupts are down. I can cast spells freely. I don't need to worry about it, um, and I won't. And I won't be punished. Those in those moments are really important, right? Because if you're in solo queue and all the interrupts are down, but you're not casting because you're afraid of something, you're not min maxing your damage. You're not min maxing your healing output. You're falling behind, and you're inevitably going to start losing if you're not aware of those situations. Which is why this this add on is particularly important to get because it's going to allow you to track incoming threats, try and plan accordingly for it, um, and then be able to know when you can freely play the game without any sort of disruption coming your way. Definitely a staple add-on. Every top player is using this. This one is going to be getting you a lot of rating if you go out and get it. Now, the number two position add-on is going to be 
Omni CD, they kind of come in pairs. We've got that one tracking enemy cooldowns, enemy interrupts, but now we need one to track our allies. And we can see it here on the left of your of your party frames. It'll track the class's cooldowns to which you can add even more. We can see in this instance, my Death Knight has activated Icebound Fortitude. And the reason that this is important is so that you're not overlapping defensive cooldowns. So uh, as the Death Knight, if they had this add-on, it would see Iron Bark and Bark Skin. And if they see Iron Bark activated uh, on themselves with it glowing, then they shouldn't use Icebound. If you stack cooldowns, you're going to run out of steam really fast in games. And this is going to be probably one of the biggest mistakes that happens uh, in solo queue. And this is an add on that just directly addresses that and can help you alleviate that from happening so that you're not losing because you're just immediately out of cooldowns right after the gate has opened. It's also going to let you know who's vulnerable on your team. Uh, so maybe you need to save a crowd control for an enemy or save a defensive cooldown if you're a healer for that target in particular into the future or dedicate your biggest heals to. To that target this is really going to help you monitor the game uh, also it lets you see your allies interrupts so if you see any incoming crowd control you can see well they might have a chance to stop it of course not everybody's going to stop it they might miss it um so but it's it's there for that information right you're going to be able to keep track of everything in an easy to access area it's gonna be right next to the big debuffs like we, we talked about earlier on um on my number five add-on up up above so it's a really good one like i again like when i'm playing with this my rating is so much lower my awareness of the game is so much worse this add-on is really helpful for organizing that information and planning out the match you definitely want to be getting this add-on regardless of healer or dps this is a really good one that's going to be getting you a lot of rating now the number one add-on it's a really a classic i really don't think it's going to come as much of a surprise to some people you you may have been anticipating something as a big surprise here but um the number one add-on for me this one's super important for overall awareness super important for offensively um closing out matches and it is the classic the staple gladius it is really important that you get an add-on for your opposing arena frames. The default arena frames have some information on it, but the information available on this is just so nicely presented. Just plug and play. You don't need to be doing any scripts, dragging anything around. Um, and you know that you're going to be getting the whole package just simply downloading it um, and then and then playing with it. And this is going to show you enemy trinkets. It's going to show you enemy Rachels, although that's not as important. Um, the trinkets to track so you can see like, hey, who doesn't have a trinket right now? Can we end the game? The healer doesn't have a trinket. I've got a stun, so I'm going to throw stun out and then go for the win right now so it just keeps your awareness to these situations um in a much more like big format which is what i like i, I just like the layout of it in general uh it's gonna help you keep track of some cooldowns as well as they're tracked on this bar if you happen to be looking at this area of the screen a lot this is a staple like uh, pretty much every top player has something going on with their opposing arena frames whether they've customized the default one i'm just personally more lazy i don't know if you're like me you just rather save time um and download this one because it just comes with every everything out of the box and you're gonna be able to track everything know how to end the game you can track diminishing returns on your opponents which is super important you're gonna see that cleanly on the left side of the frame when diminishing returns have activated and this means, oh, my Warlock feared this target. I can't Cyclone it. Or, oh, this target is immune to Roots now. I shouldn't waste my time casting Roots on it. This is important information. It's going to save you globals. It's going to be getting you ahead in the match. And as a result, it's going to be getting you more rating because if your opponents don't have it, they're not going to be doing it and not getting ahead. So very important add-ons to check out. If you guys have any add-on recommendations as well that have helped you climb the ladder in the ranks, then do please leave them in the comments down below so that we can all benefit from this information and knowledge. I do you hope that you have enjoyed this video, gotten something out of it, and been like, oh, wow, that's what that add-on was. I'm going to go get that right now because um, that's going to help me out. This is just stuff you can do immediately, right? You might be struggling, tunnel visioning, maybe you don't know your rotation perfectly, but these things will actually help you. They'll draw your attention and your uh, eyes and your ears towards information that you need to be getting, vital information that's going to start focusing your brain and your mind towards having more success in PvP, especially solo queue. So thank you very much for watching, and I will catch you in the next one.